EA Sports. It's in the game. Let's go. Alabama and Legion Field, the site for this football game. And the weather is absolutely gorgeous for today's game between the Georgia Bulldogs and the UAB Blazers. And here come the Blazers. Hi, everybody. This is Brad Nessler. With me, as always, Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit. And we're set to bring you another great matchup in the world of NCAA football. The Bulldogs are much too powerful to be stopped in this game. Kirk, what are your thoughts? Uh, there's no question about it. This one's going to be pretty ugly. Georgia is tough on defense, and you're looking at the guy who runs the show. His versatility makes him one of the best safeties in the game, and he'll be all over the field as his team will win big. Forget about it. Georgia is going to have no trouble at stopping the run in this game. Kirk, because of this, you're going to see a very aggressive style defense out there, forcing turnovers and making big plays. And the fans are on their feet awaiting the start of this game as the players line up for the kick. We should have a return on this one. Number three takes it from the six. He tries to spin. Kickoff returned 18 yards. Number three on the return. They'll set up shot at the 23. First and 10. Georgia lines up in a dime defense here. And they got him. They came after him hard there. Yeah, they sure did. And Lee, I think the quarterback felt that pressure coming from every direction. Kirk, as I've always said, the best way to keep the pressure down and to help the quarterback is to run screens and draws. The Blazers come out in the wishbone. And they hit him in the backfield. And they stopped the halfback for a loss. And let me tell you something. That toss play had no chance whatsoever. Defense was all over it. Third and 15 coming up. Ball on their own 18. Yard line. 
UAB lines up for the shotgun set, steps up in the pocket, under pressure, and he's going to come up with a sack. They can't block the defensive end, and he'll get credit for the sack. Excellent athleticism by this young man. He just beat the man in front of him, plain and simple. Fourth and long. Ball on the 13-yard line. So they're set to punt this one away. To punt. Number 31, back to return. He punts it. And this one's going to go out of bounds at the 41. And now we get to see this offense for the first time as they head out onto the field. They'll get the ball here at the 41-yard line. They'll take over at the 41-yard line. First and 10. The defense looking to make this crowd a factor. And they got him for a loss. The defense made sure he went nowhere on that run. Well, guys, when you have so many people bunched into one place, it makes it really difficult to find an opening to run to. Hey. It's second down and 12 to go. Ball on the 43. Oh, and this you. offense oh, is having a difficult time doing anything at the line of scrimmage. Ah. And he stopped behind the line. The D lineman wasn't letting anyone buy him that time. Yeah, the big fella did a heck of a job plugging up the hole where that play was supposed to go. That guy's so big, Kirk, he doesn't plug up holes. He plugs up the whole line down there. Yo! The offense is doing everything they can just to call the plays. And right now, they're not having much luck at all. He drops back. Under heavy pressure. Looks. Throws it to the outside. Brought down. Wow, a long game, but still not enough for the first. Well, the offense hurt themselves by digging themselves into a hole on first and second down, so the defense didn't really have to put too much thought in how to defend on that third down. Georgia comes to the line with three wide. Looking. Wants to throw outside, and it's incomplete. That was a calculated risk there, don't you think? Yeah, I think it was. Sometimes you have too much confidence in your offense, and it cost them there as they turned it over on downs. They'll go to work at the 37-yard line. UAB sets up in the eye. At the 37-yard line. First and 10. They'll throw on first down. Across the middle. The ball is tipped, and they couldn't hook up on that one. Not a good decision here by the quarterback throwing into coverage. So it's second and 10. Ball on their own 37. They'll line up in the wishbone. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Tackle, just a yard there. One yard gain on the play. Third and nine. Ball, Ball on the 38. The -yard line. Georgia brings in their nickel package. Let's it go. Complete. Spin move. They'll bring him down. It'll be short of the first after the completion. Well, good effort by the defense to make sure they got him before he got to the marker. And five. Ball on the 42 yard line. They send out the punting unit. In the punt. Number 31. Back deep to return. Number 86 gets it off. Number 31 fields it at the 24. The offense saw their last drive end on fourth down. Will we see a similar result this time? They'll start this drive at the 25. Number six, lines up in the deep back, high formation, can't wrap him up, brought down, a gain of three yards by the fullback. Second and seven, ball on the 28. Number six is the deep back as they line up in the eye. They are going to pitch it. 
with the spin. Tackle. So they toss it to the outside and get a big gain. Just good blocking up front, and the key there was good speed in turning a small gain into a big one. It's first and 10, ball on the 40. On the 40 yard line. Number six, lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Hand off, up the middle. Here he goes. He spins. They'll bring him down. That's a 10 yard gain. Gain of 10 on the play. Second it's second and inches. Ball, ball right around midfield. Line. The Bulldogs go with the I formation. It's tipped. Guys, someone must have gotten a hand up there because that ball came out of there kind of funny. You bet. The quarterback let it fly, but it had no chance after that big tree got in the way. Third down, less than a yard. Ball on the 50. They're really struggling now as this crowd is going absolutely insane. They'll try to power it with a fullback. He's hit and got away. And he's tackled. And he picks up the first down on the run. Good job by the fullback there, keeping the chains moving. It's first and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. The Bulldogs come out showing three wide. They'll throw on first down. Wants to get it out of the screen. They'll drop him for a loss. A four-yard loss. Second down and 14. And this is the seventh play of the current drive. Georgia comes out in the shotgun. Back to pass. Steps up, he's looking. Wants the middle, the linebacker picks it off. What an interception that one was. He seemingly came from nowhere, and boop, he took the ball. They'll, They'll set up shot at the 42-yard line. First and 10. Number four comes to the line with three wide. Drops back to pass, throws off balance. Number two with the interception, and he's taken Number down. Two, what a catch. I'm surprised he was able to hang on to that one. You know, sometimes you hear people say that defensive backs can't catch the ball very good. That's why they play defensive back instead of receiver. Well, this guy just proved that theory wrong. He can definitely catch the football. Yeah, there are some exceptions. I will definitely admit that. They're on the right side the of the 50 line. as they start First this drive. Georgia lines up in a shotgun set. He drops back. He steps up. He's looking for his man. And it falls incomplete. He just let his wide out a little too much that time. The intended receiver on the play. Second and ten. Ball on the 40. 40 yard line. And this offense is having a difficult time doing anything at the line of scrimmage. On the ground with the tailback. And down he goes. Number That'll six, be a two-yard gain. Gain of two on the play. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on the 38. UAB lines up with five defensive backs. The sellout crowd is really making a difference now as these guys can't even call the play. Back to pass. Throws it to the outside, and he's shoved out of bounds. On third and long, they get the first down, but was it close? Close or not, what a relief it is to the quarterback to have a new set of downs to work with. They line up in the shotgun. They're really struggling now as this crowd is going absolutely insane. They'll throw on first down. Going down deep and has a man. He needed a little more touch on his throw. He's got to take a deep breath, relax, and just play a little pitch and catch out there. Don't be anxious, kid. Second and 10, ball on the 30. High formation here. Nice play fake. 
Across the middle. And he can't make the catch. A bullet to the receiver, but he couldn't hang on. The quarterback put that ball right where it needed to be. That guy's got to make the catch. So another third down upcoming for the offense. Georgia comes out in the shotgun. He drops back. Steps up in the pocket. Looks. He's under some heat. Going deep. He caught it for the touchdown. touchdown. He's on a different level than everybody else, Coach. And he sure is, my friend. This kid is a real deep threat. He can stretch the defense and cause a lot of problems for the secondary. And he tacks on the extra point. So we take a moment to check out the Pontiac drive summary. Georgia, ready to kick this one off. Number three and number five back to return. He kicks it. It sails out of bounds, and that'll be a penalty. Let's get the call. Illegal procedure on the kicking team. The ball will be spotted at the 35 Well, if you're the return First team, you got to like that one. Yeah, because you get great field position, and nobody has to get hit. They'll take over at the 35-yard line. First and 10. The Blazers line up with three wide. Hut. 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 They'll throw on first down. Here comes the pressure. They'll make the sack. The fourth-year man at defensive end brings down the quarterback for the sack. That's exactly what you'd expect out of a senior. Big plays to fire this defense up. Second down and 14. Ball on the 31. 31-yard line. The Bulldogs bring in the nickel package. Tries to juke. And he's tackled. Three yards there on the delayed handoff. Three yard gain on the play. Third and 11 coming up here. Ball on the 34. Georgia brings in their nickel package. Back to pass. Steps up. Floats this one right side. So they go three and out after that incompletion. Intended receiver on the play. Hey. And 11. Ball on the 30. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Yeah. Ah. He gets it off. Number 31 fields at the 31. They're ready to start another drive, hoping to duplicate the results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. They'll get the ball here at the 34. First and 10. Number 14 is back in the gun. Makes a move, spins upfield, breaks one. And they make the stop about six yards on the quarterback draw. Gain of six on the play. Second and four. Ball on their own 40. Yard line. Here's the option. He laterals the ball. And he's tackled in the open field. That's four yards on the play. Gain of four on the play. They're down less than a yard. Ball on the 44. They're crowding the line. 
on the ground, up the middle. He's taking big moves, sheds a tackler, and he's taken down. They keep it on the ground and get the first down. Good call there on third down by the old head coach. Yeah, and also give credit to the big boys up front. They did an excellent job of allowing the back to get nice yardage there. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. And this offense is having a difficult time doing anything at the line of scrimmage. They'll give it off here. They'll bring him down. Four-yard gain by the back. Gain of four on the play. It's second down and six to go. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. Drops back to pass. Looking. He's got to throw it in a hurry. Fumble. Loose ball. And they make the stop. What happened to the football on that last play? Brad, it looks like to me the quarterback wasn't ready for the hit. Because if he was, he would have held on to that football. Well, it's easy to say that from up here in the booth. But when you're down there on the field, it's a whole other story. First and ten. Ball on the 47. UAB comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He'll dump this one off, and he's tackled. And they threw a flag on that play. Let's see what the call is. Personal foul, face mask on the defense. 15 yards from the spot of the foul. They got a little bit of help there. Yeah, they First sure down. did. They'll gladly take anything this defense is going to give them out there. It's first and ten. Ball on the 27. UAB goes with the ace set here. Draw play. And down he goes. The halfback picks up a yard. One yard gain on the play. A long ways yet to go, but at the end of one, our score, Georgia, seven, UAB, nothing. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 26-yard line. The Blazers come out in the wishbone. He drops back. Throws. Incomplete pass. The pass falls incomplete. Number 10, the intended receiver on the play. It's third down and nine to go. Ball on the 26. Yard line. Georgia lines up in a dime defense here. Pressure coming, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. So the corner blitz worked that time. Fourth and 12. Ball on the 29 yard line. Number 60 lined up for the field goal, and he's going to need some distance on this one. It's up. And it is good. This drive summary is brought to you from our good friends at Pontiac. UAB lines up for the kickoff. Kicks it off. Number 31 takes it from the six. The last time they had the ball, they gave it away on the fumble. The old ball coach was not too happy about that either. I'd hate to see that if it happens again. They'll start this drive at the 21-yard line. First and 10. 
The Bulldogs go with the I formation. Throws it to the outside. Got it to his receiver. What an outstanding play that was. Yo, that was a perfectly designed pass play. And they ran it to perfection. It's first and ten. Ball right around midfield. Georgia lines up in a shotgun set. They'll throw on first down. And they couldn't hook up on that one. That ball was off the mark, guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's get back to basics. Hey, coach, this guy looks like he's got his adrenaline flowing out there. He's a little bit too excited. Come on, Kirk. We almost caught that one. So it's second and ten. Ball right around midfield. The Bulldogs line up in an I formation. Pitch is right. He's going to try to throw. What a pick. The defense now has two interceptions in the ball game. And that's two more than the quarterback wanted to throw. Now he's got to go back out there and play smarter football when the offense takes the field again. Y you're right, Coach. The quarterback has to be able to put that out of his mind and act like it never happened. Which one? First or second interception? I say both. Number four comes to the line with three wide. And there's a fumble. And the offense will recover. And the offense somehow came up with the ball. The quarterback was very fortunate right there. You can bet he holds on to the ball with both hands next time he gets it. It's second down and five to go. Ball on the 39-yard line. UAB sets up with four receivers. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. And he stopped behind the line. That didn't go anywhere. Yeah, I'll tell you why. They were coming with the heavy blitz, and guys were shooting through the line right into the backfield. That play didn't have a chance. They're down and seven. Ball on their own 37. Georgia comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Across the middle, and he drops it. The wideout unable to catch that pass. Number 10, the intended receiver on the play. Fourth and seven. Ball on the 37-yard line. They come out in a punt formation. Number 31, back to return. Number 86 gets it off. Number 31 takes it at the 20. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. They'll set up shot at the 34. At the 34 yard line. First and 10. High formation here. On the ground with the tailback. They'll bring him down. Six, the halfback the picks up a yard. One yard gain on the play. Second, Second and nine. nine. Ball, Ball on the 35-yard line. line. Go for two. Hut. Again with a carry. He jukes. Brought down. Number they got six, four yards on, on that run. one. Gain of four on the play. Third, Third and five coming up. Ball, ball on the 39-yard line. Yard line. Ah! And they got him for a loss. An incredible series for the defense, and they get him out after three plays. That offense has to regroup and come up with a plan to move the ball down the field next time. Fourth and seven. Ball on the 37 yard line. No and surprise here five. as they prepare Number to punt five. it away. Number 11, back to return. Ah! Number 95 gets it off. Number 11 takes it to 21. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll go to work at the 25. One man backfield. 
Toss. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. That's a two-yard loss. Second it's second down 12. and 12 to go. Ball on, Ball on the 23 yard line. line. Number 30 yeah. is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Yeah. The middle. And he is drilled. He just went right through him. Man, who was supposed to block that guy? I don't think it matters, Kirk. He's playing with reckless abandon out there. It's got to be hard to block a guy that hits like that. Passing situation here on third and long. Ball on the 19. Georgia lines up with five defensive backs. Back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. Throws to the middle. Someone got a hand on it. And that one probably should have been picked off. Yeah, are you kidding me? There's a blanket around that receiver. Somebody else had to be open. Fourth and long. Ball on the 19-yard line. The special teams coach sends his punt team out on the field. Punts the ball away. Back to return. Number 31 takes it at the 43. The defense did a nice job of shutting down this offense the last time they had the ball. The offense was not clicking at all. Let's see if they're back on the same page. They'll take over at the 44-yard line. Georgia comes out with an eye formation. He's right, and they hit him in the backfield. That toss had no room to work as the defense had the hot pursuit. Man, they just scorched the field to get to him. I can see where the turf is gone. Second and 11 coming up. Ball on their own 43. UAB brings in their nickel package. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Spinning. And he's tackled. What a run. Here they give it to the tailback and a little misdirection play. And you can see the athleticism and the ability to make guys miss. Nice play. First it's first and 10. And 10. Ball, Ball on the 45. The yard line. <laughs> Here's the give. Good move. And down he goes. Number a pickup of five. The ball carrier. Five yard gain on the play. Second, Second and five top. coming up here. Ball, ball on, on the 40, 40 yard line. line. High formation here. And he's taken down. And nice running by the fullback. No question. What impresses me is the blocking up front. Just man to man. They're able to create a lane there and get a first down. First and 10. Ball on the 34. The Bulldogs come out showing three wide. They'll throw on first down. And that one's fallen incomplete. Poor pass, and his tight end couldn't reach it. The intended receiver on the play. So it's second and ten, and this is the sixth play of the drive. From the gun. High snap as he works from the gun. He tosses it short, and it's caught. And he's tackled. Just a yard there. On the reception, one yard gain on the play. Third and nine. This is the seventh play of this drive. The sellout crowd is really making a difference now as these guys can't even call the play. Watch the middle. Someone got a hand on it. And they do a good job at swatting that one away. You're right, Brad. Excellent awareness by the defender to know where the football is and is get his hand on it. Let's see if they can convert. 
They need this pass. Looks. Here they come. Waits till the last moment. That is all. That close to being intercepted. They hold on fourth down. Now that's how you get a team motivated. I wouldn't be surprised to see their offense take the field with an explosive power attack. They'll start this drive at the 33. Georgia comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Looking, wants to go long and does. And it's incomplete. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 33-yard line. Number four is back in the gun. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Brought down. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. No gain on the play. Third and 10. Ball on the 33. 33-yard line. Big Georgia guy, lines up in a dime defense here. Cut. Drops back to pass. Across the middle. It's deflected. The corner made a good play on the ball. He sure did. This kid is very athletic. If he doesn't get a pick, he does his best to knock the ball down. Fourth and ten. Ball on the 33-yard line. So they're set to punt this one away. Back to punt. Number 31, back to return. Cut. Number 86 gets it off. Number 31 fields it at the 27. He tries to spin. The offense heads out onto the field. On their last series, they opted to try and convert a fourth down, and they came up short. They'll get the ball here at the 32. Three wideouts here. Tackle. So the quarterback keeper gets maybe a yard. One yard gain on the play. Second, Second and nine. nine. Ball on the 33. On the, 33 yard line. the Bulldogs set up in the gun. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. Wants to throw outside. Got him. And he's taken down. How about your assessment of that long play, Kirk? Well, Brad, not only a big pass play, but anytime you can stretch a defense on first or second down like this, you're going to open up your running game. It's first and 10. Ball of the 29. yard line. The Bulldogs come out in a shotgun on the ground with the tailback. Number Taken nine, back a yard. Makes the tackle. One yard loss on the play. Second and 11. Ball on the 30. Ball on the 30 yard line. Number 14 lines up in the shotgun. He's looking. Rose. Complete. He spins around, and they make the stop. Number About eight yards there. Makes the reception. Gain of eight on the play. Third it's third down and three, and three to go. And this is the, the fifth play yard. of the current drive. <laughs> they keep it on the ground with the tailback. Loss Number of three. Makes the stop. Three-yard loss on the play. Right. Fourth and six. Ball on the 25-yard line. Trying to get that home field advantage, and the defense is doing their best to fire up this crowd. He gets it up, and it splits the uprights. This drive summary is brought to you from our good friends at Pontiac.
And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Number three, back to return. Here's the kick. Number five, fields it at the three. The offense gets ready to start a new drive as they just couldn't get anything going on their last possession, going three and out. They'll set up shop at the 16-yard line. UAB lines up in the bone. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. And he's taken down. Number Short six, little game the there. Just trying to keep that two, clock running. Keep that clock running. And keep that other offense off the field. Right. Second and eight coming up here. Ball on the 18-yard line. The Blazers with a full house backfield. And that'll do it for the first half of play. Our halftime score, Georgia 10, UAB 3. UAB got the ball to start the game, so they'll be kicking off to start the second half. Kicks it off. Number 31, passes it to the five. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll go to work at the 23. Start the drive at the 23-yard line. First and 10. The Bulldogs come out in a shotgun. Play action. He's going right. And he is drilled. First down. What a pass. Boy, that was a big time throw by the quarterback. He did a good job of taking what the defense gives him. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 33. Georgia sets up in the eye. They'll throw on first down. Wants to throw outside, and it falls incomplete. A lot of shoving while the pass was in the air. Let's get the call. Pass interference on the defense. Spot foul, first down. They flag the defender for interference. Yep, they saw him get there just before the ball for the penalty. First and 10. Ball on the 46. Six DBs in the lineup. They snap it to the back. Shakes off a tackle. They'll bring him down. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Three yard gain on the play. It's second down and seven to go. Ball right around midfield. The Blazers line up with six defensive backs. He drops back. Throws it to the outside. It falls incomplete. A lot of shoving while the pass was in the air. Let's get the call. Pass interference on the defense. Spot foul, first down. There was contact when the ball was in the air. I don't even think the defender bothered to look to find the ball. If you're going to hit the receiver, you've got to at least be looking for the ball. First and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. Nice play fake. And it's knocked down. Coach, you made a nice defensive play there. He sure did. He just stuck his hand out and hit the football. It's second down and ten to go. Ball on the 40. Three wide outs here. It's a direct snap. They'll drop him for a loss. And they'll lose a yard there. One yard loss on the play. Third and 11 coming up here. This is the fifth play of this drive. Georgia comes to the line with three wide. He lobs it out to the left side. And it's caught. Tackle. 
That play was designed to pick up a first down, but they didn't do it. It looks like the receiver just lost track of where he was on the field. They got to go for it on this fourth and long. They need this pass. He lets it go deep down the middle. And they couldn't hook up on that one. And the D answered the call there. And this is huge for them. It's setting up the stage for their offense to take the field and make some big time plays. They'll start this drive at the 39. First and 10. The Bulldogs bring in their second package, and he stopped behind the line. Excellent play by the defense that time as they swallowed him up before he got back to the line. It's more like they devoured him. He had no shot of breaking clean. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 39-yard line. UAB goes with the ace set here. Keep it on the ground with a tailback. He's gobbled up in the backfield. The defensive line was just too overpowering and didn't give the running back much of a chance there. Third down and 12. Ball on their own 37. They'll work from the shotgun. Hut, hut, hut. Back to pass. Throws this one out to the right. And it's incomplete. He needed a little more touch on his throw. He's got to take a deep breath, relax, and just play a little pitch and catch out there. Don't be anxious, kid. Fourth and 12. Ball on the 37-yard line. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Number 31, back to return. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. Number 31 fields it at the 17. Spin move. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. First and 10. Ball on their own 26. First and 10. Georgia sets up in the eye. He drops back. Across the middle. Oh, great catch. How about that reception, Lee? A good throw plus a nice catch and some good blocking equals to a chunk of yards. That's exactly what you practice all the time, Brad. It's first and 10. Ball on the 47-yard line. Number 14 has four receivers lined up here. Down the middle, complete, and they make the stop. Number the wide receiver four, picks up good yardage that time. Gain of eight on the play. Second, Second and two. two coming up here. Ball, Ball on the 45-yard line. Go the Bulldogs moves. go with the eye formation. Drops back to pass. Throws this one out to the left. Someone got a hand on it. Great Number defensive play the by the cover. cornerback. Third and two. Ball on the 45. On the, 45-yard line. the Bulldogs come out of the power eye. They are going to pitch it. And he's tackled. They toss it out to the tailback, and he picks up the first down. When you look at why a play like this is successful, you got to look at the guys up front. They did a heck of a job of blocking right there. It's first and 10. Ball on the 40-yard line. The Bulldogs come out in a shotgun. And he's going to lose yards on this one. This is an excellent job by the defense here to read the draw play. Yeah, the quarterback thought he could spread them out and find a hole for himself to run through. <laughs> they were having none of that, my friend. Right. 
Second and long. Ball on the 47-yard line. It's getting louder down on the field. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He's in trouble. Once and all. Going deep. It's dropped. How about that? He's got to come up with that catch here. Yeah, you're right, Coach. This is a catch that has to be made. There's really no excuse for dropping that ball. Third down and long coming up here. Ball on the 47. The Bulldogs go with the I formation. Throws! And it's caught, and he's taken down. He made the catch, but he didn't get the first down. Yeah, right now, the way this defense is swarming, there's just no room for him to get upfield for the first down. Fourth and 10. Ball on the 40-yard line. Let's see if they can convert. Here we go. Throws this one out to the left. And that one's fallen incomplete. They couldn't convert that fourth down. Boy, look at these guys out there. They are fired up. Now let's see if it's going to lead to any points. They'll take over at the 40-yard line. First and 10. Georgia puts six DBs on the field to counter this five-receiver look. He's under some heat, and he's hit hard. Kirk, how many sacks do they have now? And that gives them five for the game. This offensive line has got to do a better job of protecting their quarterback. Second and long. Ball on their own 34. yard line. They come out in a nickel. He drops back. He's going right. Someone got a hand on it. The ball is knocked to the ground. Players use anything they can to get in the way of a pass. Here's a third and long situation. Ball on the 34-yard line. The Bulldogs bring in the nickel package. High snap as he works from the gun. Here's the long ball, left side. It's deflected, so the defense gets him to go three and out. Good job here defensively forcing this incomplete pass. Fourth and long. Ball on the 34 yard No surprise here as they prepare to punt it away. Number 86 gets it off. Number 31 fields at the 29. Their last drive ended when they decided to try for it on fourth down and were turned away by the defense. They'll set up shop at the 44. The Bulldogs come out in a shotgun. Drops back to pass, steps up, looks. He's got to throw it in a hurry. It's tipped. How about that play right there? Zone coverage by the defense, and the linebacker is quick enough to react and get a hand on the ball to force the incompletion. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 44-yard line. UAB brings in their nickel package. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. That took a little too long to develop. Yeah, the offense was trying to get the pass rush going upfield, but the defense did a nice job of sniffing out the draw play and hitting them in the backfield. Third and 12 coming up on this one. Ball on the 42. The Bulldog set up in the gun. He steps up. Short toss. Oh, he had the pick and he dropped it. Good defense there, guys. I wonder if the quarterback was expecting to see man coverage there because he threw it right to the defense. And that's what's so tough about playing against the zone. You think a guy's open, and out of nowhere, a defender shows up. Just like that. And the punt team will come out. It's fourth down. Number 95 punts it, and it's a good one. Number 11 takes it at the 12. The defense did a nice job of shutting down this offense the last time they had the ball. The offense was not clicking at all. Let's see if they're back on the same page. They'll get the ball here at the 12-yard line. UAB comes out of the shotgun, back to pass, wants to get it out on the screen. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Five-yard loss on the play. Second and 15. Ball on the seven. 
the Bulldogs. Line up with six defensive backs. Hit as he throws, and he's tackled. And they get the first down on that completion, Coach. That was a very nice first down conversion. The key to that play was the fact that the quarterback had plenty of time to look downfield. It's first and 10, ball on their own 23. off to the fullback. Shed that one. And they make the stop. A gain of one. On the carry. One yard gain on the play. Second and nine. Ball on the 24-yard line. UAB comes to the line with three wide. Looking. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. They can't block the defensive end, and he'll get credit for the sack. Excellent athleticism by this young man. He just beat the man in front of him, plain and simple. It's third down and 14 to go. Ball on the 19-yard line. Georgia puts six DBs on the field to counter this five-receiver look. Throws it out there. And it falls incomplete. A little too much juice on that one. And this quarterback sometimes gets a little bit too excited back there and tries to put too much on it. He's got to relax and just make a good throw. Fourth and 14. Ball on the 19-yard line. Looks like they're going to punt it away here. Number 31, back deep to return. Hut! Number 86 gets it off. Number 31 goes at the 40. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. They'll go to work at the 46. At the 46 yard line. First and 10. They're really struggling now as this crowd is going absolutely insane. Steps up in the pocket. He's looking, and he's going to be sacked. Chalk up a sack for the linebacker. They sent the senior on the blitz, and it really paid off for him. It's second down, 15 to go. Ball on the 41-yard line. Number 14 is back in the gun. He drops back, steps up, looks. And he's going to come up with a sack. They were bringing a heavy rush on that one. Brad, that's what happens if the quarterback holds the ball too long, waiting for his receivers to get open. Third and long, ball on the 36. Number 14 comes to the line with three wide. Wants the middle, found his man. And he's all the way down to the 37. That's how you get a first down, coach. They took a risk and went for the long ball. And boy, did it pay off. Excellent play call. It's first and 10, ball on the 37. yard line. And this offense is having a difficult time doing anything at the line of scrimmage. Drops back to pass. Over the middle. Finds his receiver. The 10. Touchdown, Georgia. And he comes up with his second touchdown catch of the game right there. Kirk, this kid is tough to stop. Yeah, you're right, coach. You try to keep tabs on him, but eventually he's going to find a way to get open. I think you need to double team him. And he hits the PAT. Less than a minute remains in the third quarter with the score. Georgia, 17. UAB, 3.
And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And they'll be returning this one. Number three takes it at the eight. They're just about ready to get this drive started. After their last series had some promise, but it ended with a punt. They'll start this drive at the 20-yard line. Number four lines up in the shotgun. Back to pass. He steps up, looking. He's under pressure. Rolls to the right. Somehow gets the ball away. It's deflected. Almost intercepted. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 20. The defense lines up with 6 DB. They are going to pitch it, and he's taken down. Nothing gained on the play. No gain on the play. Third down and 10 coming up. Ball on the 20-yard line. They line up in the shotgun. He drops back. Short toss. And it's incomplete. That brings up a punting situation. I'll tell you what, this defense did a heck of a job that time to hold them to three and out. Fourth and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. No surprise here as they prepare to punt it away. Number 86 gets it off. 31 fields it at the 40. Let's see if this defense has trouble defending the pass again here. If they do, my friend, look out. They're going to give up another touchdown in a hurry. They'll take over at the 41 yard line. At the 41 yard line. First and 10. They'll work from the shotgun. Drops back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. He's looking. Throws it to the outside. Got it. And they push him out. What a catch, and that's going to give him a first down. Well, that's a big play for the offense, but I think the defense needs to play a little bit tighter in the secondary. First and 10. Ball on the 35. On the ground, up the middle. Tackle. A gain of three yards by the fullback. Three-yard gain on the play. Second and seven coming up here. Ball, Ball on the 32. The, yard line. the offense is doing everything they can just to call the plays, and right now, they're not having much luck at all. Throws, and this one's going to get intercepted. And that was interception number three for this defense, and they got to be happy about that. First and 10, ball on the 12-yard line. Number four with three ball wide receivers. They'll throw on first down. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. They brought pressure from the safety that time. Yeah, let me tell you, it looked like there was an open receiver downfield, but the quarterback just didn't have enough time to get it to him. Good defense there. Second, Second and, and long coming up here. Ball on, ball on their own four. This is a situation where you don't want to make a mistake. Here's a counter play. Brought down. A couple, maybe three yards on that run. Three yard gain on the play. It's third down and 15 to go. Ball on the seven. UAB lines up in a shotgun set. Back to pass. He's going left. 
incomplete. And they make the stop. They convert on third and long, guys. With the offense coming through in a big way that time, how about the timing on that route, Coach? Yeah, Kirk, the quarterback was able to throw to a spot, and the receiver was there to catch it for a first and ten. Nice play. First and ten. Ball on their own 31. The defense lines up with six DBs. He lets it go, complete, and they hit him in the backfield. He's going to come out. It looks like he was hurt on that last play. Yeah, I don't think it's too serious, though, guys. He's a tough athlete. I think we'll see him back in this game. It's second down now and 13 to go, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. The Bulldogs line up in a nickelback. Drops back to pass. Steps up. Looks. Wants to throw outside. He ignores the footsteps and makes the catch. And they get a few yards on that little reception. Check it out. He ran a good route on his play. And the timing of the pass was good. And they were able to get a nice game. The offense faces another third down as they line it up. On the ground, up the middle. He's gobbled up in the backfield. Kirk, they really had nothing going on that run. I'll tell you what, Brad, it's almost like he ran into a brick wall on that play. Fourth and eight. Ball on the 33-yard line. The special teams coach sends his punt team out on the field. Number 86 gets it off, and it's out of bounds at the 47. This defense did a nice job last time around, forcing the interception. And now they'll find out how much faith they've got in this kid. Do they run the football, or they let her rip? First and ten. Cut! On the ground with the tailback. Tackle, pickup of a yard for the tailback. One yard gain on the play. Second, Second and nine. nine coming up here. Ball, Ball on the 46-yard line. line. The Bulldogs line up in an I formation. <laughs> Brought down. That'll be a gain of three yards. With the carry. Three yard gain on the play. It's third down and six to go. Ball on the 43. The Bulldogs line up in the power eye formation. He drops back. Here they come. Looking across the middle. It falls incomplete. He put too much on that throw. That's his big tight end, and he's definitely not a track star. I think the quarterback just overestimated his speed. Fourth and six. Ball on the 43 yard line. It's fourth down, and the punt team lines up. Number 95 gets it off. Number 22 calls for the fair catch. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. It's first and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. UAB comes to the line with three wide. Hut. Hut, hut. Hut, hut. Hut. They'll throw on first down, loses the football, and it's picked up by one of the linemen. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Boy, they got lucky on that one. Now the quarterback has to do a better job of holding on to the football. That could have been costly. Second and long coming up here. Ball on their own eight. They line up in an eye. Back to pass. He's going left. And they couldn't hook up on that one. Number 80, the intended receiver on the play. Pass. 
passing situation here on third and long. Ball on the eight-yard eight line. The Blazers come out showing three wide. Drops back to pass. He rolls left. He's looking. Wants to get it out on the screen. And they hit him in the backfield. They didn't have the ball along there. Having ball control is important in football. And three it out is what you want to avoid for sure. Fourth and long. Ball on the six-yard line. And the punt team will come out. It's fourth down. Number 31, back deep to return. He punts it. Number 31 <laughs> takes it to 47. Not a whole lot of success there last time out. Not at all. This offense has to do a better job of staying on the field and giving their defense a chance to catch their breath. And they'll look to capitalize on the good field position here. The Bulldogs set up in the gun. He steps up, throws it to the outside. They'll bring him down. Good yardage there. And that'll move the stick. Nice time to call pass here. It looked like the defense might have been looking run. It's first and 10. Ball on the 27-yard line. They'll work from the shotgun. Here's a little draw play. He juked him out of his shoes. The running back gets two on the carry. Gain of two on the play. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 25-yard line. High formation here. Again with the run, and he's tackled. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Third now it's third and six, six coming up. Ball on the 23-yard line. The Blazers bring in their dime package. It's a direct snap, and they got him for a loss. Seven, How about seven, the play of this defensive end? This is just solid run defense here. They get a great push up front, not allowing the runner to have much room to work with. And at the end, they're able to wrap him up. Fourth and eight. Ball on the 25-yard line. Number 93 comes in to kick the field goal, and he's going to have to get a leg into this one. It's up. No good. He missed it to the left. They'll get the ball here at the 25. The Blazers line up with five receivers. They'll throw on first down. He's going right. And he went way up, and he's got the interception. Tackle. That last INT gives this defense two on the day. Not a good throw there. The quarterback needs to make better decisions. They'll About 12 yards out. At the 12-yard line. First and 10. Georgia lines up in the power eye set. Hut, hut. On the ground with the tailback. And they make Number the stop. Six, Picked up a yard of anything no on that run. On the play. On the 12, and they can smell the goal line. Back in the red zone again, where their three previous trips resulted in zero points each time. They're going to pitch it. He spins. Brought down. That's a gain of eight. The ball carrier. Gain of eight on the play. The student section's going crazy. The intensity of this place is increasing. Hut. Hut. 
They'll bring him down, and that'll be good enough to move the sticks. Yep, Brad, first and 10, do it again. Pound the ball ahead. It's getting louder down on the field. Inside Gibbs. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. UAB calls a timeout. This place is getting loud. He drops it back. Pressure coming. Let's it fly. Touchdown, Georgia. And that should just about wrap this game up, guys. Yep, that score pretty much puts this game in the books. I agree 100% with you, Kirk. If they could have stopped them or forced a turnover, they might have had a very slight chance. But a three-score lead with little time left, too much. And he hits the PAT. So here's the Pontiac Drive summary to recap what just happened. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. Here's the kick. Number three takes it at the four. Passes off the winning tackler. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made out of. Somebody get me a helmet, quickly! They'll set up shop at the 22. Number four has four receivers lined up here. They'll throw on first down. He's looking down the middle, and down he goes. First down, what a pass. Boy, that was a big-time throw by the quarterback. He did a good job of taking what the defense gives him. Number four lines up in the shotgun. They'll throw on first down. Looks, he's rolling right. Going deep, plays it out there. He's all the way down to the 27. Congratulations to our Old Spice players of the game. Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Back to pass. Steps up in the pocket. Looking across the middle. His receiver has it. A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here. And again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. The Bulldogs line up with six defensive backs. He breaks free and caught tackle. UAB takes a timeout. <laughs> UAB comes out in the shotgun. He's going left. Almost picked off. What a huge drop that was. That's an interception you've got to make, young man. No excuses. Right. Number four has five receivers lined up here. Drops back to pass. Steps up. He's looking. Look to the end zone. Did he catch it? He did. It's intercepted. And that was interception number three for this defense. And they got to be happy about that. They'll start this drive at the six. Georgia lines up in the power eye set. On 
on the ground with the tailback. And he's taken down. Number and six. they continue Ball to carrier. pound it out on the ground. Number tick, tick, tick. Play. Continue to milk that clock. Second, Second and seven. seven coming up here. Ball on, Ball on the nine-yard nine line. Yeah. UAB lines up with five Hut. defensive backs. Hut. 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 A little misdirection. <laughs> and they make the stop. Number Not six. much for the runner as he gets back to the line no of scrimmage. On the play. Third it's third seven. down and seven to go. Ball on the, Ball nine, on the nine. Georgia going with the power eye. Again with a carry. Brought down. This one's in the books, folks. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? Well, it was a pretty good game by both teams. But I was really impressed the way this game was won. Georgia came out here very focused, and they took care of business. Nice, nice win for this football team. And we That's thank you kindly for participating in NCAA Football 2005. Our final tally in this game, Georgia 24, UAB 3.